Hey, Jeff Hill again with HomeSmart. Um, I created this video so that when you are searching the MLS and you want to do comps on your own house or on a property that you're thinking uh, about looking at, um, this is all the recent sales in the uh, Scottsdale area. First thing to get started on would be to come over here and select the menu, come down here, and I've selected Live CMA for Scottsdale. I'll click on it again. It'll reload the same properties that you just saw over here on the right. But what I'm gonna do is drill down by double clicking on the map area to a subdivision that I want to check out. Um, as soon as this populates, we'll go ahead and zero in on that area. Uh, by the way, the blue dots mean that the property has closed escrow. The green ones mean that it has a, the property has an offer pending on it. So there was a subdivision right here in this area uh, that I am interested in. So what I'm going to do is go over to overlays on the top right corner of the screen, scroll down to subdivisions. It's going to draw in lines around each of the subdivisions. And here's four homes in this retreat uh, subdivision that I'm interested in. First thing I'm going to do is click on this property and then click on more info. And over on the left side of the screen, you'll see this property has been selected. What I'll do next is click on this property. It will automatically fill and be selected. I'm going to click on this property and make sure that that's clicked on selected. And I may have to get rid of this. Let's see what happens. Okay, and this property is selected. So now I have four properties selected. Let's take a look at those four and see how they compare to my home that may be for sale in, in this same subdivision. Here's information on each of them. Um, you can sort by price. Uh, this would sort by lowest price first. And that would be $282,000 is the lowest. And we can sort by highest price first. If you want to see more particulars about this home, for instance, it's highlighted right now. You would come over to the top right and click on detail. It'll tell you just about everything you want to know about the property, how many days it was on the market, uh, when it closed escrow, uh, what the original list price was, uh, the uh, cost per square foot, and what kind of financing uh, that they arranged uh, for the sale of the property. Uh, you can click on the Photos tab and scroll through the photos to get an idea of how this home might compare to the one that you're interested in in the neighborhood. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, if this home is better than the home you're looking at, then the one you're looking at would probably sell for less or be worth less. So um, this gives you an idea of some of the things you can do. Uh, of course, you can um, click on the map, which we were already at. The star indicates the property that's highlighted over here on the left. Let's click on the next one down. That's this property. We'll go to detail again quickly. You can scroll through, look at all the information. Uh, looks like this property sold for the uh, original list price and it was on uh, the market for 116 days. Another thing you can do is over here on the top right, click on the monsoon button. This will pull up all of the ownership information from the county assessor's uh, website. It'll give you uh, more information than most property owners probably want to have out there, but this gives you the deed history on the property, the loan information, uh, just all the taxes and uh, the tax and assessor's information on the property. Like I uh, said, uh, maybe more information than you really want to dig into, but at least it's available to you. If I can help you set up a search like this so that you can search properties on the MLS, I'd like you to give me a call. Once again, my name is Jeff Hill. I'm with HomeSmart, and my phone number is 602 694 
1-800-273-4333 and my email address is jeffdhill at gmail.com. You can also go to my website is www.jeffsellsarizona.com.